Hello, my name is Matthew Taylor. Today I will be showing the main ideas of limited government. This is a picture of a balance. This balance is to represent the principle of limited government. As one may notice, the sides are even. One side represents the people and the other the government. The sides are even because limited government uh, enforces equality over the people and the government. My first investigation was what the Americans feared after the Revolutionary War. The Americans feared a strong government. In this picture, it is a scared man to represent the Americans. One can infer that he is scared, and he is scared of the overpowerful government. This is a picture of the state of Connecticut. Connecticut has a fist to represent its strong government. I chose this picture to represent the failures of the Articles of Confederation that showed that state governments had to be all powerful. In this picture, it is a group of angry people. This group of rioters are symbolically mad at the government's abuse of power. Therefore, the group of people shall establish the government's limits. The Constitution limits the powers of the government to those granted by the people. This is a picture of the Constitution with a magnifying glass. I chose this picture because it corresponds with the powers made clear by the Constitution to the powers of the Congress, the President, in the judiciary. This picture corresponds with this question because it is of the Constitution with a clear text of the powers denied. This is a picture of the United States government. I chose this picture to represent the power of national and state governments powers denied by the Constitution. I chose this picture because it symbolizes the government. This relates because it is showing the powerful government and the powers it denies for the national and state governments. This is a picture of a scared man afraid of the British flag. I chose this picture to represent the farmers that were afraid of the powerful government. The farmers were afraid of a powerful government from their past experiences in Britain. This is a picture of limited government with a crown. The crown represents the superiority over the other principles of the Constitution. I encoded these pictures because limited government is the most important principle. Without limited government, the U.S. would be chaos, chaos with government's abuse of power, with it, them being allowed to do virtually anything. This is a picture of the government listening in to citizens' calls. Luckily, the principle of limited government prohibits this. Limited government gives government officials only the powers given by the Constitution. Listening in on calls goes against the rights of citizens. This is a picture of an uneven scale. The greater side is the government, and the lesser is the people. Normally, the people and the government are equal, but in this case, it is not. The uneven society would lead to chaos or a rebellion, but limited government helps balance the society and keep it intact. 